2005 WRX um, headlight and we're going to change the H1 with the LazFit H1 in here. So once it's out, we take off this connector here and you can see the original light is a little bit, a little bit wobbly. We're going to address that later. So unplug this wire clip out and remove this bulb and we take the last fit and we remove this part this is the uh, H1 okay LA series this is the it's a really nice light and we install a little groove up over here and spread it apart like that, install, and then we can see it's a little bit wobbly. So what we're gonna do is bend this clip a little bit. So bend this down a little bit here. here. So the overall goal is to get this clip to uh, push down on this a little bit more, which is it's pretty good now. And then uh, once that's ready, we install this the light straight down. And you can see that it's going to have interference between this and the heat sink. So we can't push it down all the way, so we're going to have to bend that a little bit, massage it. This so that it clears and we have success now okay and to plug this in um, you can attach this here and this is the ground so we take the ground off plug it in like this but see these are universal so um, you're gonna want to crimp this down just a little bit and this just the hair so that they fit properly it fits more snug and uh, these lights are not gonna be uh, they have polarity so if you plug them in and you I recommend turning on, plugging in everything and turning on the headlights to see if they turn on. If they don't turn on, you simply swap these connectors like this and try it again. And uh, definitely put some heat shrink or wrap a few layers of uh, electrical tape to prevent these from touching and shorting out. Okay, so that's the proper way to do it. And these will not sit back down on here. So uh, this wasn't really done yet, but you want to either leave it off or you can trim a hole in the back to clear the, the rear so that you get, uh, you get cool air going to the fan and cooling off the heat sink, which cools off the uh, chips, the LED chips, okay? So there it is. That's a little trick that you have to do with the wire. Thank you for watching, and I hope this helps you out.